Okay, today we are meeting the very influential historical figure, Elizabeth Blackwell. Welcome to the show. I'm glad to be here. All right, well, let's start off with when were you born and when did you die? I was born February 3rd, 1821 in Bristol, England. I died May 31st, 1910. Okay, could you tell me a little bit about your childhood, your upbringing? I believe in my childhood, I had a mind of my own. My father owned a sugar company and I had eight siblings. I moved to America after my father died because we were losing money because of his sugar company. And after we moved to the United States, we became, me and my family became teachers. Excellent, excellent, okay. So could you tell me, why were you famous? I was famous because I was the first female doctor and because I was a British physician. Wow, that was a huge impact on society. So back then, and even today, could you give me evidence of how you impacted today's world? I impacted today's world because I, um, I empowered females to become doctors. And I impacted on society, giving females a choice to go to a female doctor rather than a male doctor. Excellent, wow, that's a great choice. Okay, let's start with famous quotes because all historical figures have some very famous quotes. Could you give me two famous Elizabeth Blackwell famous quotes? Well, here's one. It is not easy to be a pioneer, but it's fascinating. And here's the second one. I would not trade a moment, even the worst moment for all the riches in the world. Wow, you sound like an interesting historical figure. Could you give me uh, some fun facts about Elizabeth Blackwell? I died in half seen England, I mean United Kingdom, and um, I got a degree in Glenville Medical College. Um, I, as you know, my father owned a sugar company, and I, I created a medical school for girls. Wow. And five, while I was um, treating a baby with a um, bacterial infection in his eye, I accidentally um, contaminated my eye and lost sight in it. Excellent. Well, I know there's a very, very important girl who lives here in Fort Worth, Texas that would like to ask you a couple questions. Hi, I'm Delaney Lai, and I'm so excited to be asking Elizabeth Blackwell questions. So my first one is, how many medical schools did you attend? I attended five medical schools. So another one I would ask is, did you win any awards? First of all, first six feet, please, okay? So I never won any awards when I was alive, but there is an award in my name to women to women who show outstanding service to humanity. What was your role in the American Civil War? I trained nurses for the Union side. I made sure nurses kept hygiene a number one priority. So another one would be like, what was your greatest achievement? I will opened up a women's college for medicine. The last question would be, what would you like to say for all the young women thinking about being doctors in the future. Never give up on your dreams. Always believe in yourself. You can achieve anything. Thank you for watching my biography on Elizabeth Blackwell.